Telltale und GameTap präsentieren. Sam and Max. We made pretty good time coming back from the North Pole, eh, Max? If you say so, Miss Daisy. If I'd been driving, it wouldn't have taken us a whole month to get home. Well, I've got to go drain a DeSoto. You should have taken care of that before we left. Somebody insisted that we drive through the Hudson Bay with the top down. Ah! What the hell was that all about? Hmm, unless I miss my guess, Sybil's being pursued by some kind of rogue semi-sentient interdimensional portal. Think we should try to help her? Can't think of anything better to do. Und damit halli hallöchen und herzlich willkommen zu Let's Play Sam and Max Season 2 Episode 202. Was haben wir denn hier? Üble News. Christmas saved. Santa pronounced dead at the scene. He's not dead, just in hell. Probably best if we let the kids just think he's dead. Ja. Parakeet Revolution quelled. But I suspect the pigeons are still planning a coup. Na dann, wir gucken mal, dass wir Sybil retten, wo auch immer die hin ist. Wir haben übrigens einen Monat gebraucht, um vom Nordpol hierher zu kommen. Oh, äh, Dreieck. It's some kind of semi-sentient interdimensional portal. Und jetzt? It's some kind of semi-sentient interdimensional portal. Komme ich denn da vorbei? Hier steht doch Sybil. Äh, Jimmy zwei Zahn. Well, well, Jimmy two teeth. We were wondering where you'd scampered off to. What are you doing just standing there? Stop that thing! It already sucked up Big Otis and T-Bone. Ähm, hier ist übrigens noch der Roboter. Von der letzten Episode. Schön, dass der immer noch hier liegt. Hier ist noch eine Ratte. Parkour. Was machen wir denn? So. Erst schießen, dann fragen. Hat ja nicht so viel gebracht. Ich gehe mal in mein Büro. Haben wir sonst nichts zu tun? Okay. So. Ich habe hier schon was entdeckt. There's nothing we can do to torture me Elmer that hasn't been done to him already. Yeah, we were pretty thorough last night. Ja. So, schön wieder hier zu sein übrigens in unserem Büro. Ich finde schön, dass wir diese ganzen Sachen immer sammeln hier. Nordpol. We're borrowing this from Santa's workshop until he gets back. When do you think he'll get out of hell? Probably right after it freezes over. Ja. Also wahrscheinlich nie. Sehr schön. <lacht> finde ich echt super, dass wir den ganzen Mist immer mitnehmen. Aha, Pinwand. That finger painting looks oddly familiar. I put it on the new dollar. And a crabby senator from Kentucky. Hmm. Schranktür. Ach, Leonard. Leonard looks surprisingly healthy for someone who's been in a closet for six months. I've been feeding him. <laughs> oh, you old softy. I had to find some way to get rid of all those spiders. <laughs> Der Arme, ne? Er tut mir schon leid, muss ich sagen. Also sechs Monate hier drin, na, ich weiß nicht. So, Box Betty. The finest in remote control fisticuffs. So, okay. Schranktür. Ich habe aber das Gefühl, dass wir den Ton doch noch ein Stückchen lauter machen könnten. Zumindest von den Sprechern. So, entschuldigt, machen wir gerade mal. Äh, was machen wir denn jetzt gegen dieses Dreieck da draußen? What was that about? I'm making 12 monkey chili. And do you usually forget to add the monkeys? No, I just forget to peel them. Uh, okay, Telefon. Hello, world. Uh-huh, he did? Uh-huh. That's so mean, but true. Well, gonna go, world. Call me later. Ja, ich liebe immer wieder diese Telefongespräche. The neighborhood's held up pretty well. What with all the Bermuda Triangles and robot attacks lately. Just wait until the 80-foot-tall Lagomorph stomps its flag. You're still taking those growth supplements? 
Can't you tell? Nein, leider nicht. Ich fand den Anruf bei Mr. Pizza ganz schön, aus der ersten Staffel. Max schreibt, okay, ich glaube, wir können hier nichts weiter machen. Boxer. Ich Max would stop hitting me all the time. But that's how I show affection. Well, could you stop loving me so much before 6 a.m.? No way, Sam. I could never stop loving you. Oh, das ist aber süß. Loch in der Wand. Flint's office feels empty without him. Me too. I really love that guy. Ach ja. So, anscheinend ja auch ein Detektiv. Den haben wir ja schon in der letzten Episode zumindest ansatzweise kennengelernt. So, was machen wir jetzt gegen das Dreieck? Äh. Okay. Sybil. Ich gehe mal zu Bosco. Wir hinterfragen das einfach mal nicht. Hey Bosco, what do you know about suddenly appearing interdimensional portals? I hear a lot of things. What does it look like? Three sides, reddish, chasing Sybil. Oh, what you've got there is a Bermuda Triangle. Of course. Why didn't we think of that? Wait, chasing Sybil? You mean it's here? Oh, that ain't good. That ain't good at all. Ja. Hallo Bosco übrigens. Was äh, machen wir denn jetzt? Der gute Kerl scheint ja Ahnung zu haben. Glaube ich. Ich habe keine Ahnung. Sollte... What's the Bermuda Triangle doing all the way up here? Sometimes they just like to wander. Ja. Unless it was summoned by T -H -E -M. Okay, wir sind schon wieder da angekommen. Ich, ähm, bei, bei, bei Ihnen. So, jetzt hier bitte Schrei von Bosco einfügen. Ich liebe den Schrei echt. Hm. Who summoned the triangle here? I told you, T -H -E -M. I really hope you're talking about the giant ants this time. Giant ants? That's crazy. I'm talking about the mysterious cabal of controllers who summon the triangles as sentient portals to do their dark bidding. Well, that makes sense. If there's a triangle in our neighborhood, that means they're coming. Them. Hm. Why does the Bermuda Triangle have such a grudge against all those boats and planes? Oh, the triangle got a bad rap for that. Scientists say those accidents were caused by sudden explosive outbursts of methane gas. Speaking of which... Max, don't. What, Sam? I was going to point out that many phenomena long believed to have paranormal causes have actually turned out to be far more mundane in origin. Only one phenomenon's tremendous power continues to baffle scientists and defy rational explanation. What's that? Ähm... Um, ja. Das ist wahrlich unerklärlich. How do we help Sybil? Once a triangle gets imprinted on you, it's tough to shake it. But they say you can train them if you can figure out how to communicate with them. Okay. Mit dem Bermuda Dreieck kommunizieren? Naja, gut. Ich meine, hey, können wir ja mal versuchen. Was ist so schlimm an diesem Dreieck? Why is the triangle got you so spooked? It's a bad omen, guys. They're coming for us. I'm going to work even harder to get my emergency bunker in shape. And I recommend you two do the same. Is our emergency bunker in shape, Max? It sags a little, but you try looking that good after two kids in a Y2K scare. Uh, okay. Yeah. How do we communicate with the triangle? They're very attracted to symbols and sigils. And sigils, apparently. Those two. They're not real picky. They're driven by shapes and colors. A pink rhombus makes it nostalgic for the 50s. A red octagon makes it stop whatever it's doing. A blue icosahedron makes it sit in its mom's basement and draw maps of dungeons. And they can't see or hear. So you've got to feed them a symbol of what you want them to do. Okay. Yeah, I should. We'd like to buy something. I told you fools last time, the store is closed. But I've been craving a pack of beef tarts for weeks now. It's the delicious tangy candy that makes its own gravy. Help us out, Bosco. Stop wasting my time. I'll never get the bunker ready if you two keep jabbering at me. 
dann eben nicht. You can't close the store, Bosco. Everything we value was bought or shoplifted from here. Don't you see? The end is nigh. Nigh? Yes, nigh. Wandering Bermuda Triangles, strange radio transmissions. Don't you see? It's T H E M. They're coming. I have to relocate before it's too late. Um, sie kommen. Where are you planning to go? Oh, you'd like me to tell you where my emergency bunker is. No chance. You'll have to stop goofing off and build your own. It's just like the fable of the grasshopper and the ant. If the ant were a paranoid lunatic. And the grasshoppers too, come to think of it. Ja. Not that we're planning to hide in it, but uh, where's your emergency bunker, Bosco? For the last time. My secret bunker's secret location is a secret. Okay. Keep watching the skies, Bosco. Always. So, wo kriegen wir jetzt Formen her? Wir müssen das Bermuda Dreieck ja anscheinend irgendwie füttern. Fragt mich nicht wieso. Eisschrank. Gut, Bosco ist ja ein Trilliardär, glaube ich. Also der hat wirklich genug Geld, um sich diesen ganzen Kladderadatsch hier zu leisten. Oh. Hey Max, remember Banang, the painfully strong banana flavored drink mix? Sure, it's been off the market for 10 years and I still can't get it out of my mind. Or my kidneys. Get your paws off that. It's all for the secret bunker. Ist ja gut. Der Bosco ist auch immer etwas paranoid, muss man sagen. Naja. Mhm. Na gut, wir verlassen mal den... ...das Geschäft. Ja. Ach so, stimmt. Wir können ja auch mal hier vorbeigucken. Simple. Okay. Ist überhaupt nicht merkwürdig, wollte ich sagen. Ach, übrigens... Illuminati confirmed. It's the Bermuda Triangle. Ja. Das ist absolut Illuminati confirmed, Leute. Das ist der Beweis. Sybil, De Soto. Gehen wir zu Sybil. Sybil's office is closed. What does ja. she do now, anyway? I don't know, but whatever it is, she's doing even less of it than usual. Ja, sie flieht gerade vor einem riesigen Bermuda-Dreieck. As we found out last year, at the underwear exchange, it's a lot better to give than to receive. Speak for yourself. I like meeting new fungi. <lacht> Wie bei Used Socks. Wir kaufen gebrauchte Socken. Ist auch schön. Hey, the Castrati Club is recruiting again. I thought I heard more screaming than usual last night. Okay, die suchen nach neuen Mitgliedern. Maybe it's time we stopped fighting an unwinnable war. No way, Sam. I won't rest until we've defeated gravity once and for all. Die wollen 300 Trilliarden Dollar? Ich glaube schon. Fix it tips in the aftermath of a giant robot rampage. Give me time to read it. Okay. Ja. Gut, dann lassen wir mal die Plakate sein. Wir können noch in dieses Geschäft hier gucken. Stinkies, naja. Stinkies Stube. Oh, damn it, stupid spot. Hi, Stinky. Oh, it's you guys. Hank and Jethro, was it? Sam and Max, actually. What are you doing? What? I was just taking care of some cleaning. If that's a blood stain, you should be sure to use bleach. I don't know what you're talking about. Ich weiß auch nicht, wovon ich rede. Hey, Napoleon. Oh. Hey, wen haben wir denn da? Moment, erstmal Jukebox. I don't have any quarters. No problem. The jukebox only takes 20s. Ich gehe mal lieber. So. Flint Paper haben wir hier. Aschenbecher. Heute gibt es anscheinend kein Quiz. So, Strolli-Bild. So, äh, Aschenbecher. Look, Max, it's our neighbor, Flint Paper. Hiya, fellas. Keep it on the down low, would you? I'm doing surveillance. Oh boy, real detective work. Who are you spying on? Some mug, name of Bosco. <lacht> Yeah. Stinkies has a no smoking unless you're Flint policy. Sounds a lot like their policy on homicides. Man muss ja sagen, so verrückt Bosco auch ist, der wird ja wirklich immer beobachtet und 
Es passieren hier ja wirklich paranormale Dinge. Why are you checking out Bosco, Flint? For a client, Samo. Said she was the poor chump's mom. She was a real no-nonsense dame with legs up to here. Hairy legs, but still. Ja. How goes the stakeout? Getting interesting, fellas. Bosco may be on the move. Yeah. He's acting awful suspicious. Oh, that's just Bosco. Das stimmt wohl. How's the stakeout going, Flint? Shh, this is make or break time, boys. He could hightail it out of here at any second. Okay, das könnte noch dauern. Okay, die ganzen Gegenstände haben wir uns jetzt schon in der letzten Episode angesehen. Ich hoffe, das ist jetzt nicht so schlimm, wenn wir die einfach mal beiseite lassen. Oh, viel zu gut. The Fedora never goes out of style. Or further out of style. Da hat er recht. Ein Fedora ist schon cool. Also die Hüte. Boah, Fedoras sind echt eine schicke Sache. So, ich weiß immer noch nicht, wie wir das komische Bermuda-Dreieck loswerden. Wir reden mal mit unseren abgelaufenen Computermodellen hier. Hey cops. We're sorry. We cannot handle your request until you've taken care of the noise problem. Natürlich. Wo sind die denn jetzt hin? Sind die immer noch hier drüben? Ich mache mich mal auf. Ach da. Wie werden wir denn jetzt das Dreieck los? Ähm. It's the Bermuda Triangle. Wir könnten ja mal in unseren Wagen einsteigen. Ich weiß nicht, ob das hilft. So, De Soto. Where are we going, Sam? Ja, nirgends wohin. Uh, never mind. Ähm. Ich habe immer noch meine Waffe. Jimmy Zweizahn weiß auch nichts. Miss me already, Champs? Well, I ain't coming back no matter how much you beg. The place just isn't the same without your persistent funk and wheezy snoring. Yeah, well, I'm done with that rat hole. This new place is extra class. We're gonna do it up nice. Okay, sonst noch was? You got your whole family in there? My whole crew, except for three-eyed Lenny and the Gooch. God rest him. What happened to them? Let me just say, you don't want to be hiding out in a robot's exhaust system when it loses control of its motor functions. This street needs more stringent traffic controls. Okay. Den lassen wir jetzt einfach mal liegen, den Roboter. Liegt ja schon einen Monat hier rum. Was machen wir denn jetzt gegen den... Sibbe... Oh. Wir brauchen noch Dreiecke. Finden wir denn nichts in unserem Büro? Oder generell brauchen wir ja Formen. Formen und Farben. Gar nicht einfach. Oh. Mhm. Bilder haben wir hier. Kalender. The Prismatology Blistacular Shade a Month Calendar. This month is magical. Oh Gott. Also Schreibtischlampe. Nordpol. Frosch Mariachi, das kennen wir auch schon. Rattenloch. Jimmy's old place. I'm impressed. It's even more beat up than our office. Yeah. If he thinks he's getting a security deposit back, he's crazy. See any symbolic triangle chow around here? Ja, ich bin ja schon dabei. Oh, was ich ganz vergessen hatte. The hand Jesse James used for shooting. Hey, me too! Der Hand fehlt übrigens an Finger. That finger painting looks oddly familiar. I put it on the new dollar and a crabby senator from Kentucky. Haben wir denn hier irgendwelche Formen? Ich übersehe bestimmt wieder irgendetwas. Um. I hate to say this, but I can't think of a single reason for us to be in here. 
Steven Spielberg might call about a movie option. Das wäre cool. Let's go. Great. So, dann, Moment, hier entlang. Hier finden wir ja, glaube ich, echt keine Formen. Ja. Wir verlassen das mal. Formen. Hier muss es doch irgendetwas geben. Das gibt's doch gar nicht. Ach, wahrscheinlich gab's doch in... In der Stube, in dem Restaurant, gab's wahrscheinlich doch was. Würde mich zumindest nicht wundern. I was going to make a pun about a developing situation, but I thought better of it. Mm -hmm. It's a combination microwave and x-ray machine. Perfect! Now we can see what's living inside the burrito and then watch it die. Äh, uh, ja, das ist natürlich eine schöne Sache. It's oh. like looking into Bosco's brain. Wanna bet? Not this time, little buddy. Hmm. Gedanken lesen. Das erinnert mich an was. Ich gehe nochmal in die Stube nebenan. Zeitschriften. Fotos. Hm. Also letzte Episode, muss man sagen, sind wir echt super durchgekommen. So, wir gehen nochmal hier nach drüben. Da ist auch nichts. Stinkys Stube. Hi, Stinky. What? Oh. Ja. Ich rede noch mal mit ihr. So. What are you cleaning up? Is that a blood stain? Don't be ridiculous, blood. You act like I killed Stinky or something. Grandpa, Grandpa Stinky. Oh boy, intrigue. Oh, this is just cherry marinara sauce for the meatball banana split pie Italiano. Well, that does sound tasty. Ja, sie hat bestimmt nicht ihren Opa umgebracht. Hm. Whatever happened to the original Stinky anyway? He retired. Went on an around the world cruise. Stinky hated traveling and water and the world. <lacht> well, he must have changed his mind. So are you two going to order anything? Um. What's Flint Paper doing here? I was about to ask you the same thing. He's been here all morning. Nervous about having a trio of ace detectives snooping into your little scheme, lady? Oh, don't be silly. I just have to move some things out of the meat locker. But I can't if I keep having to refill his java and empty his ashtray. Ach, ja. Next time you hear from him, tell Grandpa Stinky we said hello. Oh, I don't think we'll be hearing from him ever again. Because you sent him on a... Permanent vacation? <laughs> no, because he was a cheapskate and I refuse to collect calls. What is it with you guys? Ah, uh, yeah. A rogue triangle is chasing after Sybil. Triangle? <laughs> yeah, that's not really my thing. I specialize in the more circular interdimensional portals. Some expert. Yes, Stinky. You're an expert in portals like President Max is an expert in diplomacy. Risk is more my thing. Okay. Any ideas to help Sybil? Drop that Lincoln guy like a bad habit. We meant more short term, but thanks. Okay. What's the special today? Oh, it's just a sandwich I whipped up for the Camp David Middle East Peace Summit in 2000. Roast beef, Munster cheese on a slab of granite on sliced sourdough. Nothing special. A slab of granite? Yeah, you know, for texture. On the kids' menu, I substitute a slab of basalt. It's easier for the little ones to digest. Hmm. Ja, ich äh, gehe mal lieber. Bye, Stinky. Ähm. Hier haben wir einen Gong. It's a gong with no gonger. Where's JP Morgan when you need her? Ich habe da gerade was entdeckt. Can we borrow your sign, Stinky? It's kind of important. Well, okay. But bring it back. It's a national heirloom. That's the stop sign that would have prevented the Kennedy assassination if Connolly hadn't run it. Natürlich. Das können wir nicht mitnehmen. Jesus können wir doch bestimmt mitnehmen. 
Who is this JHC fellow? <lacht> so, Mutter Teresa, Napoleon, Gandhi. Peace, love and all that hoo-ha. Gandhi. Hey, Gabe Kaplan. Whatever happened to him? He's been masquerading as Gene Shallot, apparently. Hmm. Not pictured? His right hand. Keep on trucking. Love, Mother T. <lacht> Mother T. Flint paper. How's the stakeout going, Flint? Shh, this is make or break time, boys. He could hightail it out of here at any second. Natürlich. Na gut, dann lassen wir den Herrn mal machen. Wir haben unser Stoppschild. Und ich glaube, wir wissen schon, was wir damit erledigen. So, auf geht's. Okay. Wo haben wir denn das Schild? Oh, hier. Ich halte das schon mal bereit. Komm, liebes Dreieck. Ist auch das Typischste, dass hier auf einmal ein Dreieck auftaucht. 